Hello viewers, welcome back. So today I will speak about gravity. Probably many of you have seen this movie from Sandra Bullock and George Clooney. It was an amazing 2013 story about gravity. And therefore today I continue with gravity motors. And this one will be from John Harford. It's amazing design. As you can see on my left side on the image, it's pretty pretty clean and neat design. And you will see now in front of my face the animation, how it actually works. So it's really astonishing. So uh, as you can see is as spinning this set of wheels or these uh, rods uh, go inside and out and actually accelerate through this platform uh, on the, when, the, when it's going down as you can see and this is uh, really really amazing. So to how to explain this? It's not simple but the, it's actually really simple. So in, in I study this pattern, so you can see now in, in front of my face in just a few moments how this pattern actually looks like. So I've studied a little bit, it doesn't, it's not too complicated, but yet uh, we should read it entirely. It's, as always you have the patent in the description below to read it thoroughly to understand each and every point of this uh, model I'm showing you and uh, you will see, it's really, really amazing. So let's go to the big screen now and try to explain just a little bit. So here we are, this is the John Harford gravity motor. It's really simple design as you can see. So we have uh, this some kind of uh, rotor in the middle and we have this, uh, this wheels which are spinning on this uh, rotor and going up and down on this axis. So as the motor going down, it's going through this uh, platform and accelerates and then it goes up yeah, and then it sucks back in into this rod. So you can see, yeah? So now if you follow, accelerates down and then. So what here is missing? Actually here is missing, um, it's not perfect animation, but it's the best I could, ma I could make with my software. And um, of course, when, 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 when the wheel comes to this position, it cannot just by itself uh, go back to this position, which is required to accelerate further in the next round. So we should, in this red, let's say in this rotor, should be some kind of mechanism to, ex uh, to suck in a little bit these uh, wheels, which from this moment on accelerate further and to the maximum at this point. Yeah? And uh, maybe we, we sh just need to suck them in from this point over to, to let's say, to the horizontal level. So from, from this to the horizontal level, we suck it in with the, some kind of mechanism and then it goes by itself to the top. And th this next wheel, which is going down, actually enables this to work. So really amazing design and uh, yeah, who knows, the, uh, can it really uh, be over unity or that this continuously spin and even produce an excess amount of energy which we could extract on this generator over there. But nevertheless, amazing design, amazing gravity motor. Please read the patent in the description below and try to figure out what have I missed in my explanation. So, what to say at the end? So, the John Harford gravity motor is really, really simple. I would say, please read the patent entirely because it's not too long so I encourage you to do that and you know there are many many other gravity motors which I'm willing to make an animation if you give thumbs up and if you like this video so don't be afraid support my channel by liking it subscribing by sharing my videos on other platforms like Facebook Twitter or whatever you have just share it it will increase my community and many more enthusiasts will be able to see the actual invention, inv inventions available on the Google Patents page. So, don't go away. Until next video, stay tuned on my channel. Bye-bye.